congratulations. A great achievement for a club of Chorley's size, this, isn't it? Yeah, Chris, I mean, it was brilliant. Um, you know, it was a uh, most mm. season, to be fair, and uh, we were up there all season. And full credit to the lads, you know, uh, mentally we were strong and uh, we saw it out to the death. I suppose it's always going to be a tense finish in the Evo Stick League because nothing's nailed on, if you pardon the pun. It's not. I mean, we, we had a lot of games in hand um, probably six weeks ago and everyone was saying we're going to romp it by 10, 10, 12 points, but it doesn't work out like that and we're always going to lose games. It was just up to me to make sure the lads were, were right and we, we kept strong and kept believing and, and we did it to death. Absolutely. What kind of a manager is he? Um, first class, excellent. Good preparation, good man management qualities, uh, and gets results. I always feel that managers are more realistic and chairmen are more optimistic. So I'm going to ask you this one. How far can Chorley get in the Football League pyramid, do you think? Could you dream of playing in the Football League one day? Um, I think we look at the achievements of Accrington Stanley, Fleetwood, uh, Morecambe, who all came from non-league levels. And, you know... Surely just as capable. You've played football at the very highest level <laughs> with Blackburn and Manchester City as well. What's it like managing at, at this level that you're at now? I've enjoyed it loads to be honest with you. And I've come from everything to, to you know, painting toilets to, to doing whatever I do because I want to get it get the uh, change of rooms right for the lads and um, due to funding. Uh, you find out that you've got to do a lot more uh, than just manage the club and like I said I've enjoyed that from making sandwiches on the coach for the lads going away journeys to so loads of other stuff. Well, I suppose lifting trophies at any level is always going to give you that buzz, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, I wonder whether they cut with Blackburn and lifted that trophy, but, you know, lifting the, the trophy Saturday at, at Buxton was um, probably a little bit more special. You know, you, you've got a lot of fans who put a lot of trust in me and, and players that put trust in me and um, they're looking for my direction and, and thankfully this year um, I've given that and we, we've won the league. What do you make of, of Blackburn and City this season and, and the changes in both of those clubs since you were there? Yeah, I mean, Blackburn have had a tough run, obviously, with a changeover and, and he was born in the club. You know, they've had a good season, you know, but great, great end of season. Uh, next year, I think they could be out of a real good season in City. Obviously, uh, City family kids are too, so hopefully they've won and win the league and they're in a great position and uh, just got to win all the games now. Finally, one question about Gary. Have you had his sandwiches? What are they like? <laughs> Average. <laughs> <laughs>